What's up, Miss Brittany and gentlemen? Today I want to talk about iMessage and why it's basically your best go-to if you want a messaging program that is absolutely confidential, that your information will not get saved, your information will not be seen by the FBI, not the NSA, none of these things and it's going to be getting even better shortly a lot of people have been using signal a lot of people have been using whatsapp but again if you just have iMessage you're pretty good now iMessage has end-to-end -end encryption meaning it is encrypted on your side it's encrypted on their side so information going through the net won't be picked up by or it won't be recorded by your providers now one thing you gotta know is that if it's going over regular text not only can the NSA the FBI Uncle Sam whoever not only can all them look at it but all of your texts get saved and I know this because I knew a guy that uh, I had to train way back in the day and this guy was convicted of sending death threats to his ex-girlfriend's family and the reason they found him is they could go through his old text he got to pay his you go phone that he registered in his own name once they got the warrant it took about 35 bucks and they got all the texts that this guy ever sent and turned out hey if we never get rid of any of your stuff and you know what text doesn't take anything it doesn't take anything to save that stuff and for some reason the company just loves saving your stuff but anyways Apple will not save your stuff encrypted end to end and not even they can look at it and the FB even if the FBI NSA if they want to look at it they can't Apple thinks that you should be able to do your stuff well, perfectly, in your own time, and that no one should be able to look in at your stuff. So, one reason that this is better than Signal or WhatsApp is because it's something, it's a network, it's a very, very, very trustworthy network, and it only works on Apple devices. If somebody is going to be stealing your text or seeing your text, and you have had to jailbreak your phone and put City on it and put some dumb app that records what's going on because I'm telling you Apple will not let that go through Apple is operating system is locked up so tight it's like a frog's butt in a watermelon seed fight folks I'm telling you you can't crack it or at least you have to be super talented super super talented to um, just to give you an idea to unlock a phone the FBI paid almost a million dollars to a group to get it unlocked. That was a terrorist phone, but Apple didn't want to. St Apple didn't want to unlock that. Apple didn't want to find out how they could unlock it because they knew it would be used elsewhere. And they were right. The FBI said it wouldn't be, but the the hacker group that hacked this phone themselves got hacked. Of course, that's just how it happens. Apple didn't even want to go there. Apple's old Apple's old money these days, and they know that they oh geez, these guys have enough, these guys have more money than some countries do so now unfortunately, about the only downside of this stuff is that unless you set it up a certain way, if you send a text here, this is blue so that send is an iMessage if that sent is green then it goes over the regular ways where everyone can see now not no, normally you should, honestly I'm not worried about the NSA reading my text but I do feel that I should have the right to have something I said offhandedly be for God if I send my friend a picture of a nice looking woman or something like that I don't think that my great grandchildren should have the ability to see it we're getting more and more cameras on us we're getting more and more recording and I think it's I think it's going to be a while before we realize we don't need all this it's creepy as heck we just don't need all this observation but anyways I digress another reason why iMessage is great is because it's on the Apple and the the thing is if you go and buy one off the shelf you're okay but if you go and order one uh, an Apple phone that comes in okay then the NSA could intercept it and put something in it they probably won't but when it comes to Android stuff Android is so full of security holes it's amazing and if you download something really stupid on a rooted device it can leave you wide open to anything so it doesn't matter what you put in if you're 
phone is compromised. If you don't put a lock on your phone, nothing's going to help you, by the way. But if you're if you have an Android, it is so much easier to get compromised. I love Android, but anyone who's been on Android knows exactly what I'm talking about. So Apple is trying to make your iMessage even more private. Basically, this article gets into uh, Apple might have figured out a way to close what some activists saw as a major loophole, and that undermined the security of privacy. Ba basically, what they're getting at here is. If you get a message, it sends to all of your devices that you have uh, iMessage on. And I'm telling you, it doesn't go to all of them. I tried to set up all of my iPods and iPhones all over the house, and only about three of them at a time would actually get the message. But Apple is making it with iCloud on iOS 11 that if you delete the message on one phone, on one unit, it's going to be everywhere. Even if the users store information in the cloud, it's encrypted with the key that Apple doesn't have. So, Apple's saying soon we're going to have a way to do this without actually seeing what's in the text. They don't know what's there right now, so they can't delete it off one. Because if you if you delete it off one, Apple has to say, okay, it's this message, and we'll find this message on all other things and delete it. But now they're going to have a way to. They'll just have the key, and they can uh, they can kind of use that to figure out which one to delete on any system and geez way to go Apple bravo a lot of people will give them shit for stuff but you're doing a good job Apple that way with with the privacy and uh, it's good to have some privacy in this world I guess finally anyways that's it for me Nev from Nev's Tech Bits like subscribe leave a message if if uh, you have a problem with encryption let me know why and have a good one folks catch you later Brett